The video began circulating on Facebook this afternoon of one David Crockett middle school student on top of another punching him repeatedly. Thursday afternoon, a video of one student from David Crockett Middle School in Odessa sitting on top of another student and punching him began to circulate through social media outlets. Now, we're not showing the video because it is so graphic, and sources we spoke to close with the school say the student who was hurt is also special needs. Sean Carrasco is a local activist for our youth. He says more needs to be done. He put a stop to the violence in schools. It's become, that's the culture that we have now days it's acceptable i've said this over and over if our schools are broken our city's broken and as a community we've accepted this and and i don't think it's it's okay that we send our kids to school and pray nothing happens to them crockett principal maribel aranda says there are several consequences that can come into effect when these incidents occur uh, and it starts with our administration you know where from one they can get uh, suspended uh, they can go to AEC alternative education. ECISD police are also speaking out after the video saying the punishment for these fights can be even more severe. They'll be referred um, to municipal court for either disorderly conduct fighting or if it's a simple assault it's again municipal court. If it's a class B and above which is a class A assault or any felony assault it's referred to the Ector County Youth Center and they will um, decide what happens to the um, suspect from there. Principal Aranda says students and parents need to understand the severity these incidents can have on the students' lives in the future and talk with their kids individually at home. It's important that they understand that it's affecting their future, you know, so just so they know and our, you know, our parents are aware too that there is big consequences for our students that do get into a fight. Now, ECISD police say this case is still currently under investigation. Reporting in Odessa, Rachel Hollum, ABC, Big 2 News.